it's Dr. Allie. So we're gonna continue my series on getting a little bit more detailed about some of the neurotransmitters I spoke about at my Coffee, Booze, and Horror Flicks um, talk. And I'm gonna be talking about low acetylcholine. So acetylcholine is the neurotransmitter that's the most closely associated with Alzheimer's. So if you have low acetylcholine, many times that are those are the um, early signs of Alzheimer's. So. And again, with Alzheimer's, you can all, you can prevent it if you catch it early, and you can even reverse some of it, and you can ha do a lot better with it. But mo the doctors will wait until it gets so bad and then diagnose it rather than seeing it coming years and years in advance, right? So let's talk about low acetylcholine. So these symptoms, you want to think, okay, these are the symptoms of early Alzheimer's. So it's definitely the most important neurotransmitter I'm reading for converting short-term memory into long-term memory. And the signs of low acetylcholine are the, si are the signs of early Alzheimer's and they have to be dealt with immediately if you want to avoid Alzheimer's. Loss of visual and photographic memory, loss of verbal memory, memory lapses, impaired creativity, loss of comprehension, trouble calculating numbers, difficulty recognizing objects and faces, a slow mental response, difficulty with directions and spatial orientation, and difficulty learning new things. And these are the people that will remember something from 40 years ago, but not know what's happening right now. And so one of the most important, there's a lot of important supplements for this, but this is one of the best. I, I, I brought this one in to show you. GPC, so this is, I'm gonna read it. L-alpha glyceryl phosphor, phosphocholine, okay. Um, it's, a it's a metabolite that's isolated from lecithin, from soy lecithin. It's, it's the best supplement to raise choline, and it's the best form of choline to raise acetylcholine levels um, because it's very, it absorbs really, really well in the gast gastrointestinal tract and it crosses the blood-brain barrier. So if you're having any of those signs, any early Alzheimer's signs, any of the things that I just spoke about, you're worried about Alzheimer's, this is an, the best supplement to take. Oral intake of this supplement has been shown to increase acetylcholine levels in the brain, significantly improve cogn cognitive cap capacities in Alzheimer's disease, and um, prevent, can prevent and delay the progression of Alzheimer's. It has a tremendous potential as a nutrient to aid in stroke recovery. So this is a really, really important supplement to take. Even if you, I mean, I'm gonna start taking it. Like when I, I just learned about it um, when I started researching for this, for this workshop and I'm, a, I'm an acetylcholine dominant. And so I would have tendencies towards memory issues, even though it's not in my family. It's something that's important to take. I, want, I don't want to have any memory issues. So GPC, um, <clears throat> we'll put a picture of it. So this is what you want to do if you have any memory, any issues I talked about, if you're worried about Alzheimer's, if someone has Alzheimer's or is like, is like early stages, you want to take this like probably three times a day. So again, if you have any questions about anything I spoke about today or in my other videos, just please comment on this video and I'll get back to you right away and have a blessed day. Bye guys.